Hello YouTube, Cameron here. Today I'm on my way to explore some old ruins. They're at a uh, local golf course, which they don't really, of course we can't go, I can't go here during the summer because they don't like people coming here when it's active. But I don't think they mind during the winter since the golf course is not active. So we're going to some old ruins from the Victorian era. Taking a walkway there right now. They were at one point the clubhouse and before that they were someone's mansion. Which if I can find a picture of what it would look like, I'll show it later. Someone do a side to side comparison. Once I get up there, we're gonna walk up the hill. Okay, here's the ruins all the way up there. Beautiful. And it's gonna have a really nice view once we get up there. But look, this is the golf course. It just started snowing, the first snow of the season. Today is December 11th. Yeah. You know, I'll probably upload this much later in that so I can save enough videos for the winter. So that's how I do it, because otherwise I'd have very little to upload in the winter. I'd only be able to upload purchases rather than actual bottle hunting or digging. But yeah. So let's go. Beautiful view. Yeah. Let's show a bit longer before I turn it off. Oh, there's the remains of an old stone wall there, but they think they demolished part of it. I don't know why. See, there's a man-made lake here. That's probably why they demolished part of it. That lake might not have been there in the here. Do it to the lake. And that building up there was initially a, uh, I think Victorian era. I'm not sure exactly. Maybe older mansion. It's an address ruin. This is what we're heading over. So. I'm gonna check where that stone wall was. To see if there's any bottles or anything like that. I doubt it. It's still worth checking. It's an interesting drainage for the lake. Yeah. Look at that. It's the overflow thing. Huh, I don't want to look down there. Those are some iron deposits. Based on that orange color. There have been Native American artifacts. There's, there's a nature preserve right next to here where Native American artifacts have been found, but I haven't found any. Only like official archaeologists as far as I know. Like they're a lot harder to find than at the place where I've gone out head hunting. <laughs> I don't know if I should get snow in my shoes though, I don't want them to get soaked. I have to hope it doesn't start to melt. Oh, I should probably go back on the walkway. At least until I get there. Yeah. Huh. I see some pieces of like brick and stuff, but no bottles. Oh, look at that view. Beautiful. What a way. That's what I say. Mm -hmm. Wait. Huh, it's a snowy day. And we're on our way. I don't know if it was the right choice to take a shortcut, but what's been done has been done. One of the cousins took in the woods next to the home site. He's the dump. Huh, sand pit. Huh. This is not sticking as much there. This is the kind of house where they might have probably had a privy rather than a, a surface dump. But, and I couldn't dig a privy here. I might be able to look for something in the woods. At least during the time when the golf course isn't active, maybe in the woods they would let me. But definitely not if there was a privy. Okay, we're heading over. Ah! I'm okay. Got dirty and wet. But I'm okay. Whew. I'm okay. Oh. oh, this is what I was worried about happening. Some wet grass on a steep hill. Maybe I should cut through the woods to get there. This is slippery. And my shoes don't have great grip. Look at that view. It's gonna be even better on the other side. On the other side. Oh, look at the mountains in the distance. Oh, beautiful. Okay. I'm just getting some pictures. Almost there. See the chimney. Here we are. The ruins. 
I'm going to go make a loop around. Let's go over the view first. The Hudson River view is over there. We'll head there next. First, we're going to go over the ruins. It's at the bottom and work our way up. If you really must exist, language as a second English. Look at that it's a fireplace, that's old. Oh, look at the staircase. It's real old. I'm going to go to the upper section next. This is the biggest, the main section of the house. When your parking brake starts to fail, the staircase. First, we're going to look around the lower area. <laughs> when the softness it burned down, that's why this house was abandoned. Like a I think. I'm going to find it under the basement. We'll go there next. We'll find it. First, in here. Okay. I love about this place. It's not vandalized, really. Huh, look at that. It's an old tile here. Wedged in. Look at that. Look at this. part of the fireplace. He's made of all sorts of random bits and pieces, including some brick. Yeah, and there's the stove pipe. Let's look up. Look. Here we go. Okay. It's way too easy to look outside. I had to put the flashlight off. Look, you can see bedrock right there. I'm gonna go to the upper section next. This is an adventure. Okay, look, we'll go to that section next. First, we're gonna go down here. If we can. This is the basement. Oh, this is just one little room. Look at that old column. Look at that. Turn the flashlight, see if I can find anything old. Okay, it's time to put the flashlight on. Now we're going to find anything that I want to try. Look at this column, though. That's old. Look at that. I see some old shards. Some of these shards are old. I don't see any old bottom. That the other side is just yeah, waiting to the column, be though. discovered. I'm looking for any artifacts. There's some really old shards though. This is old. It's, it's a Coke bottle. Old shards. I don't have to find any old bottles. I'm looking for some old artifact. Some sort. Oh, the wonder. Maybe if I look very close, I can see some melted glass. Oh, Probably because there was a fire. The there's a whole bunch of glass here. Maybe I should come back with a rake. It seems like all the glass and stuff is coming from here, the ruins. Huh, maybe if I can have a thing pulled, but I can't do that legally, probably. So I know people were partying here. Huh. What is this? Oh, fireworks. I'm just doing a fireworks. All I hear are cars. And even their noises, they can't block the stars. It's the modern model. There's a lot of old shards here. Sorry. I'm going to find anything that I dig, but I can't legally dig here. Oh, that's something old. Now it's left on the windows. The present holds your company still alive. Irrigation something. It's past me up. And they can see your face. That's a new robot, at least. There are some old pieces here. Okay. Let's keep moving. I'm not finding anything here. I'm not trying to do that. I need to break this out of the pet Why? Because I'm... It's a combination of the cold and the warm jacket. Okay, now let's explore the ruins some more. Let's go around. There's the other room, which is semi-buried. Which is where I thought there could be stuff. But I can't dig that out. So we're just going to quickly go up here and explore the rest of the property. So I have to clean off the lens. Look at that staircase. Yeah, beautiful. Shame, it burned down. It was a nice house once upon a time. 
see if I can find, there is one picture of it online. I, can, I all might have come up finding the exact one. There's a column. Which is now, as you can see, the golf course part. That the other part side of the golf course. Is just waiting huh. to be okay. I mean, it's not here. And actually, oh, I guess they actually use That's one of the old fireplaces in the house. As you can see. So I guess now they actively use. When they use it, I don't know, but look at these columns. This would have been a beautiful house. It would be turning into a golf course. That's not, I don't they demolish it to make it the golf course. That, they did that after it burned down. Oh. I want to go to that lower floor. Let's figure out how to access it safely. Looking from the other side, I can. Oh, who put a goat's head there? It must be from Halloween. I don't know, Halloween was two months ago. That's weird. Let me show you. Yeah, I wonder why they did that. Weird. Let me see if I can get into the lower section safely. And then we're gonna head over to see the view and then we're done. And I'm gonna find a way out of here. Can't remember, I think a long time ago I tried to do a video here, but I never made it in time because I had gone when the golf course was active. So I wasn't allowed over here. Okay. Let's see if we can find another section. We can get into the other section. I mean, oh, I think it's got to be a better way than the thorn bushes. Oh. Yeah, there is another way up. I think over here. Over here, there's a way up. Oh, I'm gonna use it for drainage. I'm gonna show you this. Got the old floor. Probably the one's been tiled on this. Let me take a picture. I'm so tired of where I am. I'm so tired of where I am. I just put the flashlight on. Here we are. It's like the basement or something. Oh, I just look like I might actually find something. I've been jamming the ground so see if I can find anything. A lot of old shards, as you can see. Look at this. It's a Holy Coke or something, which will jar a lot of old shards in general. Nothing cold yet. Piece of metal. Oh, that's. I think it was just a modern toy rocket. Kind of might be old for a moment. Some old lids and caps here, though. It's a good sign. Then I might find something. Well, I'm hoping to find like a coin or something like that. Could have been an old toy spoon. Based on the pieces I'm finding, it was like, abandoned like the summer from the 30th century. I can't tell for sure yet, it really makes sense. I have a couple of dates or something stuff. So, not brand new, <laughs> it's, it's, not, it's not from the house era. Fortunately, there was a fire here. And even if there was anything called, it's probably, I'm probably not the first person to look at stuff here. You can see burn marks on that tile. Oh, it's an animal jaw here. Should I take it? I think I will put it to the side here. So it's a jar from an animal. Or oh, more bones here, but I don't care about the other bones. The other bones are just not interesting to me. Ooh, what's this? It's lead to a bottle, I think. Something. The vintage lid for something. I'll clean it when I get. I get home. Hopefully we'll clean up well. I don't know what it is. Oh, there's some old pieces here. I would love to dig this. But legally, I don't think I could. Ooh, vintage Pepsi can. Look at that. It's in good shape, too. That's from, like, the 60s. Hmm. Take that from my friend. Let me put that to the side. 
make a pile of stuff. Here, is this vintage? I'm not taking it, I'm just curious. Oh, it looks kind of vintage actually. A few decades old. Maybe even 70s. I found 70s. Guys, before, in other places. Never can. It's vintage, but it's all flattened, unfortunately. What do you mean a vintage Pepsi? Whoa, it's part of a pocket knife. I wonder if it's old. I hope it's old. Ooh, it is old. I see an old decal on it. Look at that. An old pocket knife. I have one. Let me see if I can find the rest of it. Nice. Or another piece of the pocket knife, I'll save that. Oh, that would have been a nice picture. Look at that. Jeez. Look at that. That would have been fancy. I'll go find something hole in here. Some digging around here. Yes, I found more of the pocket knife. I found the other half. Nice. Oh. Look at that. That would have been a beautiful picture. Look at that. I mean, look at this picture. Look at that, it's like Victorian and beautifully ornate. On two pieces. Ooh, there's more of the picture. Look at that, look at that, that's the base. Okay, back into the wild. Back into the cold. We're just going to see the view over the edge, and then we're going to head out. I'm already dirty, so my only goal is to keep my shoes clean. So that's the only thing that won't really be able to go in the washing machine. So we're going to go up to the top, and I'm going to show you the view. We're going to go up, I'll show you the view, and that's that. And we're gonna head out. Changing days turn hairs to gray. He's putting the color back in. Okay, we're going up. This is an adventure, that's for sure. It's really snowing. Look at the golf course. Okay. We'll get a better view of that from above. little tower there maybe that's water storage for like watering golf course or something I don't know there's some more structures down here you can see there and there any maintenance stuff I'm going to see the view I hear a big bird and that way you can kind of see it beautiful view We're gonna see a view on this side, and then we're gonna head out. Unfortunately, the view of the Hudson River is not as good as I remembered it to be. It would be somewhere that way, if I'm not mistaken. I know it's that way. Now I remember. It's this way. It's just unfortunately it's quite foggy, so you can't really see it. So trust me, that way is the river. I remember now. I reoriented myself. Oh, there's a plaque with the history of the of the ruins. So let's check that out. The ruins. Here's the history. Golf course was founded in 1926, but the building already existed before that. Here's the history. You can pause if you want to read it. Make it clear. That's what it used to look like. Dude, that's the staircase I just went up right there. You just walk up that staircase. 
Yeah, oh, you can see there's more ruins and stuff down that way. Okay. So that view is The better view on this side, actually. We'll quickly show that and then I'm gonna go. Okay, time to head out. It's been an adventure. We'll try to get a view, an angle from the same angle as that illustration on the plaque, and then we'll head out. Ooh, really beautiful in the winter. Let's keep walking. It'll be kind of like a, a vlog slash exploration because I'll show you my journey to and from too. Huh. Let's keep walking. I wonder if the structures down there are, are, are old or not. Well, they're probably old-ish, but I don't know if they're as old as the building here. Like, they were part of the same property. Or if they're newer. We're going. Oh, I think I see some squirrels. Squirrels. This isn't quiet for a moment. Okay, let's move. Let me be quiet and we'll just enjoy the view and the peacefulness. You'll hear the train horns too, hopefully. Oh, I turned out I could have taken that road back. Heads in. Heard the train there? Yep. I'll be quiet for now. I'm just gonna go get a picture of the lake. If I can get down. Oh, I'm gonna slip if I try to do this. Oh, and I'm not in the right clothes for sledding. God boys, I'd ask my brother to put the sled down. If you like to sled along the golf course, it's a great place for sledding. We were the first, I, we're, I, I think other people might slide here, but I know we were the first people to do it. Yeah, I think this is good enough that I can cross. This is nice, peaceful. Oh, look at that lake, beautiful. Heading down there in a moment. Sure. One thing a bit low on power, so soon we'll have to only film when something happens. We'll film for like two or three more minutes, and then we'll wait until something happens if I film at all more. Otherwise, I'll be back with the review. It's time for goodbyes. Okay. It's time to say what's you. Nice though, beautiful. But I do something different and do a bit less editing. Just try something different. I think it's very nice and peaceful with the snow. The golf course. Hello YouTube, Cameron here, I'm back with a review, let's get started. First there's this pocket knife, which based on my research, 
and it's in multiple pieces, and I don't know if I even have all the pieces, but anyway, I believe it dates to about the 1950s, but unfortunately it's falling apart, so that's just going to be for scope length. Yeah. There's all the other pieces. And there's an animal jawbone. No idea what animal it is. Let me know if you know. Then there's this tab, which is from a bottle of some sort. It's definitely vintage. Not sure what, though. Let me get that to focus. Yeah. Probably not going to keep that, though, but I'll clean it up first and then decide. There's this mystery item. Not sure what it is. Or what it's made out of. Then there's this plain button. Yeah. It's not too exciting in terms of fun, but it's still an interesting video, which is why I'm still going to upload it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.